So act, uh, actually, there's a, I, I want to show you, you guys, a sample of the trouble code. So um, sample of the trouble code, because uh, I did use so, a lot of time video, or it's still okay, I will go on. Okay, so um, example for the DDC, okay. So uh, for example one, this is operate, operation for, for your customer to, to check the trouble code. But some of, the, uh, some of your customer may complaining why, uh, why the trouble code cannot be clear. So in, in here, uh, I, want, I want to show you just uh, not every trouble code you can clear with the current. You see there is a current P0340. There is a current uh, code for this. If you have history code, you can clear it uh, easy. But if the current code, you may not because there is a current problem with it. So uh, I will I will I will I will recognize uh, this work this uh, website for for your customer. Actually, this website we still have Chinese version and uh, all many language inside that uh, you, you choose uh, what you want. So inside here, maybe you can you you can uh, tell them that you can search it here. But if you search it here, uh, you you will see like this. Okay. So what's uh, what you want to focus on? Actually, this workshop, uh, th this website can teach your customer. Okay. What's this customer? Uh, what's this uh, trouble code meaning? So that's why they no need to interrupt you uh, every uh, every time. So they, they won't directly call you, hey, what is this problem? And then uh, before they call you, they, they can around, around uh, already know what this is about. So actually uh, this very good website and other website, there's many more websites that talk about trouble code and help uh, f help for us to diagnosis. Okay, so I want uh, I will I will show this video because this is a video for the operation of the XC1 Pro. Okay, so this is a Pro operation. Okay, so I will share with this video. Okay, so um, this video is uh, actually this car is cannot be start because the, there is some of the problem. It cannot start, but uh, this engine fail cannot start. Okay, after that, Use uh, X431. So uh, to set up this X31 Pro, actually very easy. You just use the uh, the connector. This long cable. Don't forget to 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 tell your customer. You must use this cable to avoid your your connector. Uh, loosen your connector. So many people use this uh, connector. We forgot this connector inside the car, and and the, then the car gone, and the, and its connector also gone. So just plug in the connector inside. Okay, now start with the diagnosis. You uh, so you uh, just hit it. What's the model inside here? So and check it. Uh, the health report. So this is the operation 
for the health report. So it will come out the uh, trouble trouble system only. So once you get the trouble code, try to check out what the what uh, the the sensor location. Not suppose that the trouble code clear trouble code not supposed on it. Okay. Once you see the the sensor and you found the defect, so the wiring are really broken. So and after you fix it, so this is how, how I fix the wiring. It's not too it's not it's not too tidy, uh, but it's still connect. Okay, after connection, so uh, you still can check uh, with the trouble code and you, you you clear the trouble code. Once the call, trouble code can clear, double check, make sure double check with the read trouble code. So make sure it's no trouble code. And then you started the car and test it. You see the car already start, problem already solved. So what I want to show you guys is uh, not suppose the trouble code come out it only you 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 only clear it, but also you need to be uh, double check with the the problem. Okay.